What's good? It's your man, so we can't tell you what he do. And you know I got to bring you on the other side of the world with you. Everybody talking about Israel. Everybody talking about Gaza. Everybody talking about Pakistan. Everybody talking about Ukraine. Everybody talking about World War Three. But let me tell you something. The politics over there is crazy. Most of y'all don't even know that Israel was ran by one of those Rothschilds. Since what? Like 47, 48? So, uh, I want y'all to hear something. Because this is very important because we're supposed to have some type of, you know, alliance with Israel, right? Or some democratic bullshit, right? The problem with Israel is with the young generation of the next community. She said the problem with Israel is with the young generation of the black community. How is the young generation of the black community a threat to Israel? First question. We all the way over here in America. What do we got to do with over there? You, you feel me? That's, can y'all answer that question y'all says? Because <laughs> I'm still trying to figure it out. What does us over here have to do with over there? <laughs> They're just trying to wheel y'all in on some shit. But you know what's going on? To me, I think they're afraid of the revolution. Just like most of y'all motherfuckers are. Black Lives Matter starts there. She was like, Black Lives Matter starts there. You know, yes, that's true. But the people that run Black Lives Matter are three lesbian chicks that are Marxists. You can watch the TED talk. She said it. She's here to destroy the family. They also took the money from all the black communities and, and built mansions. Didn't give back to the black community at all. Yeah. So in conclusion, if y'all don't know it or not, Israel is an occupation over there in Palestine. The enemy runs both sides of the war. Don't fall for the okie doke. Viva la revolution. That's why they scared. Let's go.